Ricky here, and you're watching Ricky Talk Shop. Uh, thank you guys for tuning in. Today we're, uh, we're back with our uh, Red Llama project. If you haven't seen the first video, be sure to check that out. Um, after, after I shot that first video, I, uh, I talked to my customer, kind of discussed exactly what he wanted, and we came up with two versions of the pedal. The first one over here is the same as his circuit in his pedal that he sent me. Um, the only thing we changed is I added a voltage switch. Um, if you watch the other video, that was the, uh, the mod that made the biggest difference, um, was changing, uh, changing the voltage that feeds the pedal. Um, I did experiment with a uh, pot to adjust that. It, it just felt kind of twitchy, and uh, I, I didn't think it worked really well, so we went with a switch. Um, <clears throat> and I'll show you what that does in a minute. Our other one, this pedal is, uh, it's got the same voltage switch, but uh, we, we added those larger capacitors to get a little more low end out of it. Um, he said I, th I think they're gonna play around with like some bass guitar and maybe some keyboards with it. Um, so that's interesting, that's kind of cool. Um, I do have here to show you the original pedal that I had to work with. And uh, here's the inside of that. A little bit of a rat's nest going on. Um, part of my OCD does kind of want to go in and clean that up, but um, the guy is really happy with this pedal, and that's not, it's not exactly the job I was hired to do. <laughs> Um, and it does work. It sounds good. And here is one of our new pedals. I built four of these for the guy. We got three, three of the normal version and one with uh, the bigger low end. Um, and here's my layout with that. Um, you guys can see what that looks like. All right. Good enough. Let's uh, show you what uh, what these guys sound like. So here is our uh, our normal pedal, and this is in uh, the high voltage mode. And here we'll uh, we'll sag that down. You'll see the, the LED um, dims a bit. I could have wired the LED straight to the power source um, on the other side of the resistors and it wouldn't do that, but I thought that was kind of cool. And there's that, that little bit fuzzy low end. And the top end just isn't as punchy. Here, this is our, our uh, pedal with the, the more low end, and this will this would make a bigger difference on uh, with a bass guitar or a keyboard or something like that, which is how they intend to use it. You can kind of hear that difference there. The top end, the mids feel very similar. Um, here's a low voltage mode. Um, there you have it give you an idea a little bit of what these sound like um, this this I gotta say this was a really really fun project um, this, is, this is a little bit different circuit because it uses that uh, digital 
IC chip rather than a traditional op amp. Um, so that, that's fun to play with, a little different. Um, and there we have it. I'll, uh, I'll get these uh, packaged up and uh, ready to ship out. Um, until next time, thank you guys for watching. Have a good day.